Hey guys, welcome back to my video. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing my bookish box uh, for this month. I cannot tell you what month this is, to be honest. So, there's a cat outside. Okay, um, let's go ahead and let's look through here. Let's see what we have. So let me see if I can get the pamphlet out first. Yes, so this is for July of 2022 this month and this is the adult box i know that so far so yeah let's move on so the first thing that i can pull out here that's two things um so the first thing here is this this is the crescent city um star wars shelf sil silhouette and i love these these are really really pretty so this is my first one that i received from the bucket box but i like these a lot these are really nice so this is inspired by Crescent City. I love this. This is a nice design, and basically, you just put them on your bookshelf, um, and they just kind of just hang out right here, which you know, and they just look pretty. So <laughs> yeah, I, I like that. So this one was the next item. So. We have this, which is a wallet inspired by the All Souls trilogy. Never heard of that, um, and I don't, I, I don't need a wallet this big for me personally. Um, and this also feels very cheap, and the quality, it's fine. There's a magnet. I also don't like the pattern design on here at all. It's just not for me. I'm sure people out there will love this, but not me personally. And it does say in every inning three, I mean, in every, oh my God, in every inning there is a new beginning. So yeah, I mean, it's there's a lot of room, so there's that, but I just, I won't be using this and I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but we have that. Okay, so the next item is a foil bookmark. Which, I love receiving bookmarks, um, especially if they have foiling on it. Um, I love that shit. So, yeah. And this is inspired by J.R.R. Tolkien, which I do not like the, the author, but this is, this is really pretty. I really love this bookmark. It's really, really nice. And then the back is there. This is really pretty. I love this a lot. And it says, but in the end, it's only a passing thing this shadow even darkness must pass um i love this bookmark very pretty i love this a lot so even though, even if i don't like the author at least it's pretty so i like that and then we have this item right here which is inspired by the four the four horsemen series and this is a wine stalker i don't really drink wine um but here it is <laughs> um it's a nice design i actually like this a lot it's really really pretty um so, at least it looks pretty, but I don't drink wine, so, it looks nice. <laughs> so, the next item that we have inside here is our mountain candle, which I like that they do, a mountain candle. And this is inspired by a quart of silver flames. Um, so, let's go ahead and get this out. So, here it is. It's a nice little thingy picture right there. Val Airs. I think that's how you pronounce it. Don't know. I'm definitely wrong. But very small, very nice. Let's see how it smells. I love this smell. It smells really, really good. It's probably my favorite smell that the book box had done. Um, the one from the ones I received. Um, I love this smell a lot. I can't tell you what it smells like. It smells kind of fruity, actually. Uh, let me see if the little book like here that they give us tell us what it smells like because I couldn't tell you um it says stuff but I'm not really sure if it really tells you what it smells like but I really love this kind of it smells really, really good so that's all that matters that it smells good and I'm happy that I have it in here so yeah so then we have um the bookish stop sticker that they always the bookish box sticker that they always include and then we have um, like a little introduction or something and then we have Book Daddies which is though August 2022 which I guess is the next month so 
so yeah, and then it gives you a, a sneak peek of what to expect from the Bookish Daddy August um, box. So yeah, so the next for next month um, sneak peek is an item inspired by the Love Up Assist by the Hazelwood, which is nice. I think it's the shirt design sneak peek, which I don't get a shirt in the box, so probably not for me, but yeah, that's cool. And lastly, we have the book here. Um, let's open it. So I will say, um, they did send out replacements for the dust jacket, which I put the replacement on already, um, and then I have the original dust jacket here, um, which I will explain what was the difference from what I've seen. Um, yeah. So the month monthly book is What Lies Beyond the Bell by Harper Lee L. Woods. Um, I really like the cover, very nice, and then it has some beautiful rainbow indorescent foiling on it, which is so pretty. I'm not sure if you can really tell, but yeah, it's throughout the whole book, even on the spine and on the back here. And then we have purple spray edges on the top and bottom. And then we have like digitally sprayed edges here. Which I don't like these edges. I think they're kind of ugly to be honest. These, I feel like they could have done better for these. But these are just very ugly to me. So I don't really like that. And then we have... Uh, let me take this off. Yes. Oops. So I guess we do what's on the actual hardcover here. So we have this. Which is similar to the cover. Again, nice beautiful folding on here. Which I love. Um, and then also on the back we have some more folding on it. These are really pretty. I love the folding that they did on here. It says, come on my star, show them how bright you burn. Yeah, it's a little cool on there. I like it. This is really pretty. I really like it naked. And then we have these beautiful end pages on here. And then on the back. I just feel like the art is a little too dark. Like, it's kind of hard to tell. Like, kind of hard to see to be honest because it's just too dark i just want them to be a little brighter so you can actually see the art better but whatever so yeah so the, then we have a reversal dust jacket on here again this is the replacement that we received which i like a lot and i would have chosen this to be um like the cover but it doesn't have the title on here, which I wish it did, but it doesn't. And again, I feel like the art that they did is too dark. Like, it's kind of hard to see the characters. Like, I just wish they brightened it up because it's too dark. Um, but that's the only complaint I have because these, again, it has the beautiful foiling on it. So let's compare the original and the replacement touch jacket. So... Here's the original one, and it's basically the same for the front cover, but the reversible side, it has none of the foiling on it, as you can see. It has no foil on it, and they fixed that with the replacement. And then they also, um, the original does not have tags on the spine here, or a foil on the back here, so they added that to the replacement um, copy, as you can see. So it has the title, and it added a quote here, which states, if this is what your hate feels like, then I can't wait to feel your love, which I love that quote. Um, so there's that. And then also, on the original one, they had nothing on, like, the end pages here. They're blank. Um, so yeah, and then on the replacement copy, they added this beautiful design on it, which I love on um, both of them. So, yeah. I love, what they, I love that they did that, and they sent it out right away. Um, yeah, I'm glad to have the replacement copy, but I just wish they added the title to the characters right here, and I just wish the characters were brighter, same with the end pages, because it's so dark, it's kind of hard to see them, so that's my only complaint about the book, and of course, I guess the hideous spray edges, but I guess that's how they want them to look like, um, but I'm not a fan of them, <laughs> but... It is a pretty book though, and I can't wait to read um, this book. Um, and I like it. And I like all the items except for the wallet, and I guess the wine stopper, 
Uh, the one stopper is nice, I just don't have any use for it. But that's everything in this box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what your thoughts on the book and the book. It's like the the whole book, fan pages and everything. Let me know what you guys think of it. Um, make sure you thumbs up, comment below, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.